Okay, so I just arrived back to New York and this is what I've arrived into. This is a lot of boxes. This is my couch. Cabinet, I think. A mirror. Hopefully that one's not broken. And there are my boxes. So I don't actually know what that is. So we're gonna have a busy, a busy day tomorrow. Yeah, I had to unpack the mirror to see if it was uh, broken and it's not. Delighted. So I have one box unpacked to start. Good morning from New York. I'm so happy to be back. I was in Portugal for a few days for my friend's wedding and had so much fun. As you can hear in my voice, I have like a cold now from all the traveling and I'm absolutely wrecked, but it was so worth it. It was so fun. And now I'm back and I'm so ready to get stuck in. It was actually kind of a good thing because when I came back, everything's here. So now I can really get stuck in. All my boxes that I shipped from home have arrived. Um, uh, my mirror arrived and it's not cracked this time, so that's good. And my couch arrived, my bed was here, so I'm gonna get that built today with every, along with everything else. My dresser arrived, um, some other bits and pieces of the house, like bed sheets, just random pieces, you know, like my usual Amazon orders. So I'm very excited to get set up. I'm so excited to have a bed and to have a couch. I just feel like from then, when I have those things, I can kind of start building around them and it's really gonna start feeling like a home. So I literally have set aside the whole of today, it's like seven o'clock here, it's very early. I've set aside the whole of today to just get set up here. At eight o'clock, there's someone coming from TaskRabbit to build them. Um, it's basically a service, kind of like a handyman service you can pay for, and they can just build everything. They have all the tools, they can do it really quickly, um, and you pay them by the hour, so uh, it's brilliant. Like, um, have my groceries arriving at two, and what else? Oh yeah, actually, I had a couple of questions about, before I left, about who I was using to ship all my boxes over, and I didn't want to recommend anybody until the stuff arrived, and I still have to unpack them and make sure everything's okay, but I used getcracking.ie, and I hadn't heard of them before. I was a little bit nervous because I hadn't heard anybody who'd used them, but they were the best value I could find and the fastest service. I didn't want to be without my boxes for like months because it's just really hard to plan then. Um, and like there's almost really no point in shipping them if you're not going to get the stuff for months, you know, you'll have replaced everything. So uh, I used the, the air and courier service, which was four to six days once they were picked up. So it was brilliant, like it was really fast. Like I'm only here two weeks and they're here. They've been here a couple of days. So I am really happy with that um, and I'll unpack everything and make sure everything's okay but so far so good. They dropped off the boxes when before I left, you probably saw that if you watched that vlog, they gave me bubble wrap, they gave me tape, picked up the stuff, it was just, there was no hassle, like literally no hassle at all. So um, yeah, okay, I'm gonna go unpack now. had our first little accident tan spilt in my box of home stuff I thought it'd be safe in between all the frames but tan is just so sensitive it must have gone through the bag where did I put that bag okay let's not get it on anything else I think it literally just got on this this sheet so it's not too bad what is that sheet anyway oh, it's just a ah it was a new fitted sheet I bought from Penny is the trip it doesn't matter that's okay, it's actually too small for my bed anyway because a double in Ireland, double bed in Ireland is the equivalent of like a a full size bed here, I think. Full, yeah. And then here, people buy queens more often than they buy fulls, if that makes sense. It's just a little bit bigger, so. I'm doing pretty good. I've unpacked three boxes maybe. Uh, I've kind, kind of put off the clothes for now because I, don't, I thought my dresser arrived and it didn't, so I'm, I don't really have anywhere to put things. I feel like organizing things is gonna be a problem for a while until I have all the right storage things. And actually, this is something maybe you can help with. Anyone who's watching from the US or even Ireland, if you have any suggestions, or wherever you're watching from, if you have any suggestions, okay? So I have a little bit of space here in the bathroom, look. Like obviously not that, can you see, not, like, not that much space. I don't want it to like block the toilet, I don't want it to make it like cluttered, but I'd love to have a little storage thing there for some toiletries because I have this storage under here, 
but it's just not really enough like because I get so much guys here now just In progress at the bed. This is Stephen from Ireland who's building it. What are the chances? So it's just kind of like a bottom part. This is storage underneath as well and then the mattress goes on top. I didn't get one with a headboard but um, I can always add one later if I want to. It's like a bomb has hit. So I'm unpacking but I have to find homes for all these places, for all these things. I have a wash on, a dryer on, we're getting there. Excuse the state of me, we've been building stuff all morning. This is Stephen from Task Rabbit. And what are the chances that he's Irish? From Dublin. From Dublin. When you choose from a list of like 100, hundreds of people, and he's also a fashion photographer. So I think we were meant to be brought together. We were, we were. <laughs> and you did a great job building my couch. And welcome to New York, <laughs> Thanks. Oh my God, look at my couch. It's so nice. It fits perfectly. My window's filling up. Place is an absolute pigsty. And I do like my bed. I love how the color scheme is coming together, like pink, gray, white. I didn't really plan that to be in both rooms, but it kind of works, doesn't it? Uh, I'm gonna get a headboard for the back of the bed but I and I'm also thinking I'm gonna regret this part of the bed because I have a feeling I'm gonna walk into it a lot Ugh. but anyway I do love it I'm really happy with it just casually sitting on my very own couch my brick couch I've ever owned and I love it and I love it the sun is shining through for me I love that we have a non-craft mirror in front of me. I love that I'm almost through all my boxes and that the guy who built the furniture was so nice. Today is a good day. As you can hear, I am like blocked up and dying <laughs> with a cold. I need to go out to the pharmacy to get stuff. Um, and I need to get stuff for lunch too. Oh, this couch is so comfy. I just went out there to get lunch because I'm actually really hungry and my groceries, they were, they were supposed to arrive between two and four. And I just can't wait. Um, so I got some, I'll show you, I got a salad in my local deli. Looks delicious. And I got some cold and flu medicine. Hopefully this will work. groceries arrived and my flowers arrived. I'm not gonna lie, I've seen flowers in better shape, but they still cute. I got this like weird green coloring. I don't know whether to find it pretty or like mutant flowers, I don't know. But they look cute, look. Um, and then my other groceries arrived. So I'm gonna unpack that. Now I got more LaCroix because I forgot I had more down here. It's weird over here, like some of the stuff doesn't go out of date for ages. I don't know whether to trust it or not. So until I know for definite, I'm gonna get rid of stuff like the same way I would at home. But they do actually last like way longer over here. Like turkey rashers, it says they have to be consumed within seven days of opening them. Like at home, you'd have to throw them out after like three days, four days maybe. So I um, guess they have more uh, preservatives and stuff. And food over here. I'm gonna put you here. Hustling in the bin. We got some organic milk. Probably not going to drink that amount of milk. Got some turkey, some, you know, from the deli, like cold cut, which I love. At the moment, I love turkey. And I got some watermelon. I got some apples. Mmm, they look nice. Got some raspberries. So healthy. Look at me go. 
But when you can see all the other chocolate in my fridge right now, I've literally never had so much chocolate in, um, in my house. I can't help myself, like when I just can't. When I see it, I want it. Like sometimes I can, but like when I'm feeling like chocolate, and if it's in front of me, I will just eat it. So I think I'm gonna have to, um, I'm gonna have to like find somewhere else to put it because I just wanna forget about it until like I have visitors or something for like a good excuse to eat it. But you know what I mean? I don't at the moment because I just came back from holidays. Sorry, yogurts, strawberries, mushrooms, uh, corn, <laughs> uh, broccoli, Okay, I'll put this in the bag. Fresh broccoli. I forgot to get more turkey bacon. What's wrong with me? Carrots for my hummus. More yogurts. They love their plastic over here. Like everything's packaged so much. So bad. We're so much more conscious in Ireland. Um. You don't have to pay for back of bags over here either. I'd say that won't last for long though. Okay, I'm almost done. Kitchen roll. Tomatoes. Organic toma tomatoes. Some sugar for my tea. Yes, I have sugar in my tea. And I got Diet Dr. Pepper, my favorite. I'm so weird. I don't know many people who like this, but I like it. Um, I dressed up in the Canada Dr. Pepper once when I was in sixth year. Cool like that. Um, okay, that's it. That's all I got. Yeah, that's it. Okay, bye. There was just a knock at the door, and this was there with the delivery man. So I had been someone from YSL had been emailing them, and I'm arranging to meet them. But they sent out all this stuff. How nice is that from the US team? I'm actually like so excited that like one of my favorite brands has sent this to me. So they're all like kind of like core products. So you've got Touche Cla, which is a concealer. Um, uh, this product which is like for after your skincare to kind of clear out pores or to make your skin look flawless. Mascara and then all these lip stains. You've got blush here, hang on. Look at that, how gorgeous. Packaging is so pretty. I'm like, will I lay these around my apartment? They'd actually match the decor. <laughs> and then this palette, Sexy Tomboy this is called. How nice is that? Actually so happy. Thank you, YSL. Okay, and that's it, that's the last box empty. Okay, saying that, both my wardrobes are pretty much full. And we still have to find homes for all these clothes. But like, it's kind of a weird time now because it's in between seasons. So I'm putting away some summer stuff, but it's still hot out. And like, I have all the storage under my bed, which is empty right now. And then I still have my cabinet left to come. So hopefully that will fit a lot. Hello, I'm taking a little breather. I sat down, it's an unplanned breather. And I can't get back up. <laughs> um, yeah, today was good. It was really productive. I have unpacked all the boxes except for there's clothes on the floor in there so I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with the wardrobe um because I need more a little bit more storage not so much more though I'm I'm impressed kind of but uh, I would probably have to just cut down on the amount of stuff that I have um and then I'm going to look for a coffee table for here I am unsure if I'll leave the couch this close to the window I'm thinking I might move it out and put a little table there but I'm, I'm for the moment I'll leave it anyway I'm gonna maybe get a desk for here or else a bar cart. Probably a desk would be more practical. Um, I'll show you what I mean with the wardrobe. So it's full. I have boxes here, but I could put a little rail here and put those boxes underneath the rail. And then you could still walk in and you could still reach everything. So, and this is, and I also have my cabinet. I have to come here as well. But like I have to fit all of this stuff. And there's a box of tops there as well. But that's it. That's all I have to fit in. Just this and this, and that's it. Um, oh my God, my bed's looking very cozy right now. <laughs> I have food out, defrosting, salmon. I don't know if it'll be defrosted though. Um, I have a wash on, I have the dishwasher on. I'm very productive today, but I'm gonna definitely have an early night tonight because I need it. I am so wrecked and I just feel myself so run down. But um, I'm glad I got so much done today. It makes me feel so much better. So yeah, that's the update. Oh, actually one more thing. You know the way the guy was Irish earlier? When I was looking to book that guy last night, there was hundreds of people you could choose from. And I did not know he was Irish. I just picked him because he had good reviews. I just, 
and it was so funny because he was just so nice he made me feel really comfortable and at ease and stuff um so when i get when my cabinet arrives and when well, my, my dresser arrives and when i get my headboard and stuff i'm going to get him to come back um yeah he was just really nice i didn't record too much while he was here because i didn't want to make him uncomfortable like he didn't mind i did ask him but i didn't want to make him uncomfortable so that's why i couldn't really talk you through everything um but yeah that's the update from today hey and that's the last of the boxes wrapped up i actually can't believe i got all that done today so this is everything i have to find a home for but i do have my cabinet coming so i'll take a lot of them and then i'm gonna get something in here Wow, that's a lot of clothes. Oh my God, I can't believe how much I got done today. Wow, I'm so happy. Okay, now I need to cook my dinner. My salmon looks like it's defrosted. Okay, dinner is on the way. I'm a new woman this week. I have seasoning, I have garlic salt, I have herbs, I might throw some of those on too. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing, but it's gonna be tasty. And I have some veg here too. Okay, I was a bit freaked because when the salmon cooks, it cooks and it's pink. But I think it's because it's wild salmon, it's a different type. Like it definitely was on for long enough. So hopefully it's nice. Okay, what a difference a day can make. Like seriously, this was 24 hours. Look at the difference. This was all boxes. So I'm really, really, really happy. Uh, right now I'm just trying to decide what I'm gonna buy next. <laughs> What I'm trying to decide where I'm gonna put things and what makes the most sense because I do want to jump on it and do it now and not leave it for months and months and have gotten you know what I mean I kind of want to get what I need now but anyway I'm just really happy with how this looks and my little bedroom hang on and we have not got a storage solution just yet but I did order a nightstand and we'll get there and I changed my picture here too it says life takes you to unexpected places, the haunties bring you home. And then my favorite quote, have courage and be kind. And I'm gonna change that, <laughs> I'm over that. So yeah, that's it, I have boiled a kettle for the first time. I am gonna chill on the couch and enjoy my homely apartment and buy furniture. Hopefully edit this vlog and get this up for you as soon as I can. Uh, thank you so much for all the messages and all the support. Um, I haven't been able to get back to everybody. I've just been so busy doing everything else. I haven't even really been able to read them all But um, I know that you're all there and I really appreciate the support So thank you so much and I can't wait to keep updating you. Good night guys